pottery is really special because it's really different from most other kinds of art forms in that it, um, it's more intimately involved with other people's lives than any other kind of art form. Yeah. It's Roman diva. Hmm? The diva? The diva. Not only do they get to look at it, but they get to hold it, they get to wash it, they get to eat out of it. And so people get really involved with these things and they tell us stories about what, how, what a difference they make in their lives and we love that. You have to pay me for me to teach you how to do it properly. To throw, to trim well enough for my. The process of making a pot has a long history, and it it starts with digging it out of the digging dirt out of the ground, if you will, uh, and putting it together special kind of dirt, clay. So we take this clay, we wedge it up. It's wedging is like the kneading of clay and forming it in such a way that it's easy to center on the wheel and uh, throw it on a potter's wheel. We use some moisture uh, liquid clay. We add it to the pot, the clay, and start spinning it. We press into it to add, force it to conform to our hands, which centers it because it's sort of lumpy to start off with and then it comes into a zzz. As you lean into it, it comes into a centered mass and then you can really open nice it house. and, you know, do this thing where you, you cause the center to go down and then you pull it out and then you can throw it. And we'll let it set out, put it on racks, let it dry for, uh, for a mug. It would probably take about 10 to 30 minutes before it's dry enough to put a handle on. So you know where you're going to be at Making art with heart means um, putting into our work the enjoyment we have from of touching clay and creating something that people are going to have in their lives for a long time. That's how we put heart into things. We, we, we know that people are going to enjoy them. We try to make people happy. That's one of the things that drives us. We love making things that people, uh, that help make them feel like life is worth living. We are honored and blown away by that, that people have carried our pots as far as Antarctica and China and Africa, as well as in the next, you know, next door. Being in a beautiful place like this, it's uh, easy to put, put the joy of nature into what we do. It's just uh, kind of putting that energy in. And we're very aware of how pottery lasts in people's lives. So the, it is kind of odd and wonderful that our customers think it's the coolest thing to carry, to buy something from here and carry it around. So they not only take them to their local neighbors and local friends, but uh, they carry our pots all over the world. And um, how does that make me feel? Well, it feels pretty cool. <laughs>